Besides basic calculations, you can also uh, use something called functions. So let's say I want to bring up something like an average or let's say I want to bring up its count or so forth. Then I can use something called functions right here. So over here, you can see that I got four of these. And if I want to add them all in one go, I can simply use a function. For example, I can press equals to right here, equal to, and I'm going to say sum. So that's a function right there. So you can see that these are the functions that are actually available. There are a lot of functions that you can choose from. And over here, you can open up the bracket. So that's the start. And it gives a hint. So here, I have to type in the number one. So I'm going to say this. I'm going to hold shift and click on this value right here because I want the sum of all of the values right here. And you can see that all of them are selected. Close the bracket, press enter, and there you go. You directly get a sum without having to select each cell right here. I can also do that with average, so I can press equals to right here. So I'm going to say average, and here you go. You can actually see that the average is there. So I can say average, and here, let me just uh, delete that out, press this one, and hold shift, select this one. So all of these are selected, and there you go. There's the average value right here. So that is how you can actually use functions. Just press equal to right here. And if you were to press in any number, just like this, any letter over here, you can see that there are a lot of uh, functions that you can choose from. So you can experiment and see what all of them does. And over here, you can also go to the effects menu right here to access those functions. So simply go on to the insert function setting right here. And here you can see that there are a lot of functions over here. You can also go to help on the function so that you know what exactly the function does. So this is the max value, minimum value, and so forth. So let's say I want to use max, for example, over here. Let's bring out the max value. So I'm going to say max, and then I'm going to uh, open up the bracket, choose this one till here, close this out, and there you go. This is the max value right here, as you can see right here. So if I want to, uh, uh, and divide that out. Let's say I want the um, I want other value this to be max I'm just going to say one right here and you can see that now this is the max value right there So that is how you can easily use functions to create uh, a lot of values inside of Microsoft Excel Hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe <laughs>